You know, we all try to make a difference in life, and fortunately here in Santa Cruz, Santa Cruz Next has found four people that actually do that. This is Greg Archer, and you are at the Nexties. Can you talk about how this event came to be and why you wanted it to happen? Well, you know, part of our mission of Santa Cruz Next is to um, inform, inspire, and involve. And we've done a really great job over the last few years of giving people information about things that we think they should care about and also involving them in service projects. But we wanted to do something in a really big way that would inspire um, our members and the community at large. And so we found these amazing stories of people in Santa Cruz who are doing really inspiring things. And we thought, let's find a huge platform to sort of tell these stories from. And that's why we did the Nexties. The idea is that we want to recognize the people in our town uh, who are younger and doing extraordinary things. They could live anywhere they want, but they choose to make their home in Santa Cruz and give back to the community. So we hope this is going to be an annual event and a great party tonight. The four people that we picked are amazing people and are going to just totally kick this off well. So you're winning an award for your work in Grind Out Hunger among other things. Why is hunger such an important issue for you? Um, I just feel that you know I work with the youth at my skate shop and uh, there's, the statistic is that one in four kids are going hungry in Santa Cruz County and for me it just was a little too much for me to sit by and not do, do something or get involved and so I decided to use the skate shop and the coolness around that and create Grind Out Hunger and go talk to the kids in the schools and hopefully help have the kids help the kids end hunger. I like things that explode so I work in sort of stellar fireworks. I, uh, I study how stars basically die and how elements are formed. You know we're all made of stars and we're all made of the remnants of the stars and the you know, the, the nucleosynthetic products, which is, you know, the metals that are produced inside stars, ultimately give rise to life. So we're all sort of in the cycle of, of stellar death in some way. So we're all one. Yeah, you can say that, yeah. I told you. You know, I'm a cake designer, first and foremost, and all the reality TV stuff just kind of came to me. I've done several Food Network challenges. As a result, I ended up on Oprah, which was very cool, but... Um, we love her. We love Oprah. <laughs> very amazing um, but you know honestly I'm just somebody that makes cakes I've been lucky enough to be recognized for it nationally and now locally which honestly means more to me um, and yeah I'm just me <laughs> I am most optimistic about um, continuing the work of, um, of the community center but doing it with our allies in the greater Santa Cruz community so um, I think there's new energy there's um, new support and um, a newfound gratitude from the kids and the families that are served through the community center. Um, and so this newfound appreciation for like an old jewel, something you had but polished up, and I like that. I think this event is a great representation of what communities do when they come together. Nobody got paid to do this, we're all volunteers. We've got artists and industrial designers and tech people and event planners and just um, everybody came together to put on a great show. So that's what gets me jazzed about Santa Cruz is just seeing that come together every day. Thank <laughs> you.